Today I decided to go to two of my favorite thrift stores all in one day, all in one video. Honestly, this is not like a rare occasion. This is actually a pretty normal thing for me to do. I just somehow haven't filmed this type of video where I actually show you guys both of the thrift stores in one video. At least maybe, maybe I have. I actually don't think so. So the first thrift store that is my number one love, my favorite, you guys already know, it is the Rockford Rescue Mission thrift store. I just love this thrift store so much. The number one thing that I have been looking for and I just, I'm trying to manifest it today and that is brown pants. I need to find brown jeans that are high-waisted and like the perfect boot cut or just like the perfect wide leg jeans. I just really want to find brown ones. I feel like it's so hard to find. So it's 325 right now. Really not sure how that happened, but it is gonna get dark in like an hour. So actually probably like a half an hour. I don't even know, but we should go inside before that happens. And yeah, I'm gonna take you guys along. I hope you guys enjoy and let's go inside. Hello, this is definitely brown. They don't really look that high-waisted. Oh, I don't really like those pockets. But, you know, it is brown, so at least we found that. We got some Ralph Lauren pants. These honestly look like super cute. We still can't try stuff on, but these could be really cute. So I'm gonna grab these. I feel like I would have worn this last year or a few years ago. Again, I feel like I would have worn this last year. Maybe, actually maybe not. The rhinestones are a little much. Ooh, wait, this is so cute. Okay, I'm obsessed with this. It's from New York and Company. It's a medium. I love this. This looks so cozy. We're definitely gonna pick this up. This is just a nice, simple sweater. It's from Liz Claiborne. But I don't, I'm not really, I don't know. I don't love it for me. This is actually pretty cute. I don't, it looks a little bit small, but I like that. Okay, this is actually pretty cute as well. Of course, I would find another green item. That's just what happens, but I don't know. I like this, but I don't know if I love it. Who remembers 4-H? I also thrifted a 4-H shirt probably like last year, but this one's not as cute, but we have to always recognize 4-H. If you guys were in 4-H, comment below. This is actually pretty cute. Again, I don't think this is really my style, but still very cute. So I haven't really been into cardigans. I honestly think I got rid of all of them in my closet, so I don't have any. But I've been seeing so much good inspiration lately on styling cardigans. I just found this one, which I don't know if it will fit, but I really like the look of this one. So I'm gonna hold on to it. It's $5. Okay, so I'm just gonna try them on right now because I'm very curious to see if I will like them. Because it's been probably like two years since I've put on a cardigan, so not a cardigan. Have I been saying cardigan this whole time? What is this called? Blazer. Oh my gosh, why was I, why was I saying cardigan this whole time? Okay. Anyways, let me do a little fashion show runway edition. Just stay tuned. Now let me just see what it looks like without my mask. I just needed to see the full the full effect. I think it's pretty cute. Is it like too small? I don't know, I need somebody to help me. I'm gonna pass on it, but I think I will be looking out for blazers in the future. I just have to find my perfect one because I'm not gonna settle for this, even though it's cute. 
I just feel like there's a better one. Okay, this is actually so cute. I don't know if it will fit me, but I want to say this is a dress. But it's a little bit on the shorter side, but it looks so cute. I love this beige color. And it actually still has the tags on. Definitely either from the 90s or 80s, just from the tag. Looks like it was originally from TJ Maxx. And the price was $80, but then TJ Maxx was selling it for $40. And here they're selling it for $3. And I believe the blue tags are 20% off. So I feel like I need to get this. This is just so cute. What is this? Oh, okay. It's a jacket. Okay, I thought this was a jumpsuit at first and I started to freak out. But it is just a coat, which... Is, wait, is it? What is going on here? Okay, I think it's just a coat, but it's very interesting coat so yeah all right we got another one of these interesting coats but this one has some stars on it so we got a nice variety here today i swear this has been here for like two years it is the weirdest fabric so i understand why it's still here okay so i had to check out their home decor and i just found these super cute coasters okay i think these are so beautiful i love the color I'm not like in love with this gold stripe, however, so I'm a little on the fence, but I just feel like these are so cute. Like, I don't know. I just like the pink color and they're only $2, but do I need them? Probably not. I'm just going to hold on to them because I literally cannot decide. Okay, these are kind of cute, actually. These little heart candles. Okay, so I've actually been on the lookout for a jewelry holder, and I feel like this might be perfect. They have like these little hooks on this, and I feel like I could take off this chain because I don't really like that, but I could like nail it into the wall and maybe even paint it. But I just feel like this is actually very practical because it has a ton of these little hooks. And it's only a dollar, so I think I'm gonna pick this up. And I feel like I've already decided that I don't want this. So I'm gonna leave it behind. But I am gonna get this dopey mug that I just dropped in front of an audience. So this table is only four dollars. And I kind of love it. I guess this is supposed to be for chess, but I honestly kind of love it just for like decor. If I didn't already have a coffee table, I feel like this would be a great coffee table for $4. Like, it's crazy. Also, is this cute? This is only $5. <laughs> like, the prices here are crazy. I feel like I like the silhouette of it, but I don't love the pattern. Okay, I've actually been needing a new lampshade, and I feel like this one will fit perfectly. It just looks like it's in really good condition, so I'm gonna pick this up. I also really like this shade because it's pink, but I don't, actually that's pretty cute too. I just like don't need too many more, if any. Let me just see how much this is though. It's literally only $4 for this whole thing. Also, this is really cute, but sadly it just says it's sold. But this is actually super cute. I actually really like this for like my bedroom. Okay, so. I've been wanting one of these little portable camcorders just because, I don't know, I've just been wanting to like experiment more with something like this. I do not know if this works and also, I don't know how to charge this now that I think about it. So this, wait, is this battery charged? Hold on. So I just have to find one of these chargers. But that's good that it came with it. Let's see, I wonder when this was made but i'm gonna get this because ten dollars is a steal let's just hope it works i will keep you guys updated to see if this will work okay so i just left that thrift store and i ended up spending 73 dollars and not 73 23 dollars and 73 cents and that includes the ten dollar camcorder which i am actually so excited it's probably like my favorite thing that i thrifted today and I hopefully it works. It is only 4.38 and we got to go to our next thrift store, which I think closes at 6, so I think we'll be good. But we will probably be leaving when it is pitch black outside, which is 
not my favorite thing in the world. So the thrift store that I'm going to be going to is the Goodwill on State Street. And this is by far my favorite Goodwill in the area. definitely had the skirt back in the day it's like bringing me back I love this thing so much if I can find a picture I will definitely include it because literally I was in love I just loved the little arrows <laughs> like oh my gosh bringing me back but yeah I think this is like from Target or something yeah Massimo so funny okay so I found a few things not a ton but I found this jean jacket which I thought was really cute because it has this little like beige corduroy little detail on the collar as well as on the arm okay my video camera just died so let me show you guys the other pieces really quick so I found both of these little sweaters which I thought were super cute this one is 100% cashmere and it's from a lucky brand so I thought that was so cute I don't know if it's gonna fit me though and then this one is also 100% cashmere and I just think it's so buttery soft, it's so cute. But yeah, I think I'm gonna go home soon because I think it's closing pretty soon. Also this McDonald's sign is kind of a vibe right now. But anyways, okay, I will check back with you guys when I get home. Bye. Okay, so it's the next day and I'm gonna show you guys everything that I thrifted yesterday. And I ended up not finding anything at the second location at Goodwill. I, for some reason, just like couldn't really find anything. And I wanna say that it's because I've been there so many times over the last few weeks that I feel like everything that I saw, I've already seen before. But anyways, usually I find some stuff there, but not this time, unfortunately. But I did end up finding so many things at the first thrift store. So I'm gonna just jump into that and show you guys what I found. Okay, so first off, I found these Ralph Lauren jeans and I really like the color of it. I felt like they would fit nicely. I couldn't like confirm because that location still doesn't have their changing rooms open, which is kind of annoying. I feel like all the other ones are open by now, but yeah, I couldn't try these on, so I will do a little try on portion, of course, and let you guys know if these fit. But yeah, they're just Ralph Lauren. So these jeans were $4.99 and the yellow tag, I believe is 20% off. I always forget because they have like five different colors and each one is a different percentage off. And that's another reason I like the thrift stores because you always get like an extra percentage off, except for I think it's like the blue, I don't know. I Blue and green I think are the only ones that don't have a percentage off. But yeah, the yellow I think is 20% off. So yeah, I just thought this was a good deal for $5 for a nice pair of jeans, you really can't beat that. Okay, the next thing I got is a little bit random, but I got this Ron John little zip up, and yeah, it just has like the logo and the stripes down the side, and the big logo in the back. I'm not like a huge like surfing, well, you know what, I did surf in California like twice, and it was so fun actually. And I, I did it like the last few weeks that I lived there, but I feel like if I would have done it a little bit earlier, I would have gotten more into it. But I basically just got this because I wanted more zip ups. So I had totally forgot that I put this in my cart, but when I got up to the cash register, I decided that I was just gonna leave it behind. But the lady uh, kind of talked me into getting it because it was originally $5 and she was like, oh, I'll give it to you for a dollar. So then I was like, okay, I guess I'll get it because it's only a dollar and I kind of felt bad saying no after like it was in my cart, you know? I was like, it's a dollar, like let me just get it. And I feel like it's actually pretty cute though and I probably will wear it quite a bit because I just feel like zip ups come in handy so often, like more than I even thought because I only have two. I have a black one and a gray one. I feel like I wear them all the time. So I just think this one will actually get a lot of use out of it. So excited about this. Okay, next up I found this super cute beige dress and it was actually in the vest section. So I think somebody thought this was a vest because it is rather short and I do not have high hopes that this will fit me. I kind of just got it just in case I wanted to gift it to one of my friends, but I'm definitely going to try it on and like see. Although I really could wear this like a vest, like I could wear it open. So I'm going to try to style it to see if, um, I don't know if it's going to fit though. Like I'm just going to tell you that right now. 
no high hopes on that but it had its tags ready and it just like so freaking cute so I just couldn't pass it up so it's by the brand Rena Rowan and it's made in the Philippines it's a size 6 but how cute is this I just could not pass it up so the next piece is actually something that I found for my little niece, Madeline, who just turned like seven months, I think she is now. But how cute is this little Adidas little velvet jacket? I just couldn't pass this up. I thought it was so cute. It was only a dollar, so I knew she had to come home with me. I think this is so cute. And Madeline will definitely look so adorable in this. So excited to give this to her. I feel like I'm always like thrifting things for my niece, but I never really show you guys. Next up, I just found a few accessories and just like random items. The first one is this little Dumbo. Wait, not Dumbo. I keep calling it Dumbo for some reason. This little dopey mug. How cute is this? I just feel like this is so vintagey and adorable. It is plastic, which I'm usually not, I don't know. I usually don't like to like thrift plastic items, but I just feel like this being dopey. Okay, the sun is like, presenting herself and this felt very retro and vintage to me so i wanted to pick it up it was only a dollar and yeah i don't know if i'll actually use it but i feel like i don't know this is just so cute for decor had to get this i just love finding disney things at the thrift store i think it's so fun it's not as common as you think to like find really cool disney things because i feel like people know their worth and they just like thrift them up or they'd never get rid of them so yeah so cute i love this next up i thrifted this little jewelry organizer and i've been looking for something similar to this for so long i just need a place to put all of my necklaces specifically i just feel like i have so many necklaces and they get all jumbled up and they're just like it's pretty chaotic honestly so i am so excited to store them on here and i saw so much potential when i found this at the thrift store because first off like this little chain needs to go it just looks very cheap but i figured i could take this off pretty easily and then spray paint this i'm thinking like a pink color like a light pink color and i just feel like this will just look so much better at some point i'm going to be doing a bedroom makeover along with my living room makeover and my office makeover so stay tuned for those they are coming i feel like my living room is gonna be the first one i just need a couch and then like that video is basically done i think this is going to be a diy that i do for my bedroom but yeah this was only a dollar so i really could not pass this up and i'm just so excited to have a place for my necklaces it's just gonna be a game changer honestly and lastly i did end up getting this video camera and at the time when i found it at the thrift store i thought i found gold i thought this is life-changing like i got this for ten dollars it's gonna be amazing and then I came home and did some research and realized that the charger alone cost like $40. And then at that rate, I could have just bought like a brand new one of these because these are so cheap now that I'm like, what do I even do? So I think I'm just going to buy the charger and then if I don't like it or if like, because I don't even know if this quality is even good. And also if any of you guys have this camcorder or have had it in the past, let me know what the quality is because I feel like it's not going to be very good. But I don't need it to be like crisp and like 4K by any means. I just don't want it to be like super, you know. Also, this black, that is where that, it's like kind of like coming off like this black material. So yeah, that's fun. I don't know. Did I just waste $10? Let me know in the comments if I wasted $10 or if you think this is going to be amazing. I would love to hear your guys' thoughts on this. <laughs> also, I did forget to mention that I ended up getting this lampshade and I think it looks really nice with the lamp base that I already had. So really happy about that. It's actually currently in my bedroom. So very happy that I found that. So that is it for this video. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you guys in my next video. Peace.